Super excited to have this lead up to Paris. It's a time where we're fully committed to full-time training every day, day in and day out, just preparing the best that we can as a team, building that connection and camaraderie um, to get our ultimate goal of gold in Paris. It's honestly crazy how quickly time has gone by. Um, I think back to 2022 World Championships and just to think how much growth this team has had and we still have so much room to grow, but it's so exciting and I just can't believe it's officially like around the corner. I think as soon as the new year hit and it was 2024 and we we're just hitting that 200 days mark, everybody's just got this fresh energy right away and, and ready to grind, you know, just give it another push and test limits and I think that's where we're at right now and you can just tell people are excited. It's the year of, finally. In 1924, the Olympics also happened in Paris, so it's really cool, like it's kind of the 100 year reunion in a sense. Just looking at the history of this team, I mean, um, being three-time Olympians, I know for us newcomers, uh, trying to make our first Olympics, I know for us we're just kind of trying to continue that legacy but also make sure we enjoy our own journey in this. Um, we want to repeat that success but we want to do it in our way and just make sure um, through like values like resiliency, togetherness um, and just connection we really want to make the most of it and enjoy one another but also enjoy playing at the highest level together. Honestly seeing those posts on social media and just on the news around um, it really, it felt like it came out of nowhere and like we were training for so long that being able to see that 200 day mark was super exciting, super motivating, just a reminder that it's kind of, it's coming around the corner pretty quick. I'd be excited to see the, the city of love once again and I mean this tournament, it's a tournament of gods, of super human abilities and it'd be amazing to play amongst the best in the world, playing on one of the best teams in the world and I'm I know I'm very fortunate to play and compete at this level and on another note, spectators haven't seen the Olympics live since 2016 so I think that the energy, the atmosphere is going to be just electric and just the Olympic magic is just going to be unreal.